Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. And since we've no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Open my calendars, shall we? Okay, let's see. Day two, yes. Here we go. Here it is. I see it. Hmm, how do I open it now? that daily reviving concentrate that's super nice and this is amino acid shampoo for all hair types cool that's super nice two days of the lint calendar let's see day one is here Cute little lint bear. And day two. Where are you? Here. Here we go. Ah, I'm kind of struggling. Okay. Milk chocolate. Nice. Hey guys, and welcome to Vlogmas day two. So, as you can tell, I just showered and uh, I thought I'm gonna turn the camera on and show you what I do just after the shower with my skin and my hair. My skin is so dry, like, it's like a desert. When I move my face, it's like, I feel like it's cracking. <laughs> I think it's because of the aircon that I use all the time to heat up my room. <sighs> I feel like a lizard. So, with my hair. So this is my damn hair. The first thing I do, so I only really use just oil in my hair. Sometimes I would use leave-in conditioners, but most of the times um, just an oil is enough for me. So the two oils that I use are these. Gizu by Negan Mircelei and Moroccan Oil Light. These are my favorite and the ingredients are pretty much the same. So either or will work. Um, maybe Moroccan Oil is a little bit heavier, but it's the light version. So it's still very light for fine hair. Oh my God, my hands as well. They're so dry. Need to use a hand cream. So I take about this much. It smells amazing. I just love the smell of Moroccan oil. So that's about it. Then I brush out my hair and for that, so I have two brushes that I love to use. I have my Mason Pearson brush, but I don't use it on damp hair, only on dry hair. But when my hair is wet and I have super tangly hair, I use Tangle Teaser. So this is the original Tangle Teaser, but um, I mostly use this one, which I believe is called Tangle Teaser Shine or Finishing Brush. I can't remember exactly, but I really like it. I feel like it's quite soft on my hair and it helps me brush it out so quickly. Then I just go on and blow dry my hair with a blow dryer and use my JHD uh, curler. Other times I just let it air dry. It, like for example, if I shower at night, I'm just gonna leave it for a little bit while I'm gonna do my makeup. Let's try this Kiehl's Daily Reviving Concentrate because it's for daytime. So I'm quite curious. That might be too much. Ah!
Oh wow, it smells so good. Oh, it's like exactly what my skin needed. Mm, it feels amazing. Applying an oil on a lizard dry skin. It's like my skin is soaking it all in. Don't forget the neck as well. I'm even gonna apply it on my hands because why not? Mm, it feels so nice. And it's very light, it's not a heavy oil. Oh, another um, reason my skin is dry is because I've been using my uh, Lancome overnight peel and my um, like glycolic acid and spot treatment, like everything. I'm, I was just piling everything at once to get rid of those blemishes. And that I feel like with the heating dried out my skin so badly. One more drop, I'm gonna have some of it for tomorrow as well, which is nice. Oh yeah. It smells nice, it's like a botanical um, scent. Kind of lemony, so herbs and lemon. Then I'm gonna apply a bit of makeup, but it's uh, Saturday and I don't really need to wear makeup around the house. I'm gonna use my Clinique Anti-Blemish Solutions foundation. Okay. By the way, all of the snow that you saw yesterday has now melted and it's like no snow anymore at all. Which is so disappointing, isn't it? It's like winter wonderland is gone. So today in the evening I'm gonna announce the winner of yesterday's giveaway. Look out for that. What are your weekend plans, guys? Ooh, today is actually the day where they light up um, our Christmas tree in Klaipeda. Will I go to see it? I don't know. Could it be nice? Um, but yeah, I didn't really think about that. Ooh, the sun is out. Looks very pretty. Look how beautiful that looks. It's like the sky is dark. But the sun is out, so it's all very sunlit and pretty. I'm gonna use Catrice Camouflage Cream Concealer in Ivory. Um, I need to get a new one actually because I've had this one for so long. And now I'm just gonna apply my pure bronzer. I forget to adjust the brightness when I'm sitting in front of the window. Sorry about that. So on weekends, I don't do eyeshadow. I just run this bronzer on my eyelids. A little bit of blusher. done. I'm not gonna pencil in my brows, I'm just gonna use my Eyelure eyebrow gel. I'm just gonna run that through my brows. Okay, I'm gonna whack on some lip balm. No lipstick. And maybe a touch of mascara. I'm not gonna use primer, I'm just gonna use this L'Oreal Paradise Ecstatic Mascara, which is kind of growing on me. I still cannot say I love it. I think it's getting better as it is drying up. I'm done now, this is my face of the day. My hair is still damp, so I think I'm gonna Go downstairs to eat. By the way guys, yesterday I did an opening of a present that I was sent. So I filmed it yesterday, but because uh, yesterday's vlog was so long, I thought I'm gonna insert it into today's vlog. So while I'll be eating, you can enjoy that. So no guys, there will be no opening, unfortunately, because silly me, I made a big mistake and I've deleted the footage of me opening the gift box that Monica sent me. 
I thought that I had imported it in uh, my editing program already, but I hadn't. And I deleted it from my memory card just to make more space for the new day of Vlogmas. And I'm so sad that it happened this time because that was like my genuine reaction opening the box on camera for Monica to see. I'm so sorry, Monica. You will not get to see me opening the box, but I'm gonna show you what she sent me. And everything was so beautifully packaged. Thankfully, I took a picture of everything. So I'm gonna insert the picture of how the box looked. I've already eaten a couple of things. So, she tends to send me presents. You shouldn't, Monica, or any of you guys who shouldn't send me presents. But maybe that makes her happy, I don't know, um, like giving to people. So thank you so, so much. I did a makeup on her in my studio once and the last time I met her was in Vilnius in my NYX masterclass. She came there, we had a nice conversation. She sent me a Lind calendar and when I opened the box, I couldn't believe it because I was actually going to go to Maxima to look for Lind advent calendar because my cousin told that we have Lind calendars this year. I opened the box and I saw one. I was like, yes! I will not need to go and search for it. So thank you so, so much, Monica. She sent me a um, lint beer, which no Christmas can be done without a lint chocolate beer. Oh, by the way, she sent me this gorgeous Christmas card. Look at these stars and moon. So, so pretty. And I'm not gonna read it, but inside she wrote that these are all of the presents to create a cozy advent for you. Because she said it's not just about Christmas, it's the lead up to it. So she said these are all of the things that you need to do. create a more cozy advent period with uh, your cat Louis. Because she also sent some presents for Louis. So she sent these whiskers treats. He already had some of those. And uh, she also sent him this new reindeer toy. Look at him, look at him. He's already watching me. He's like, oh, what is this sound? What is this crackling sound? Louis. <laughs> Here we go. Here he is. Louis. <laughs> So thank you, Monica Lee is loving his toy. And then she sent me two Kinder Bueno chocolates because she knows these are my favorite. She sent me them last year as well. And I already ate one pack, so yeah. <laughs> and she also sent me these amazing Lithuanian cereal bars, which again, I also ate them because they were so good. One but with bananas, another one with blueberries, and they're amazing. Stunningly beautiful black tea. It's called... Uh, golden Christmas and it's like the most me tea ever. It has gold flakes and gold stars in it So beautiful. I've never seen such pretty Festive tea. Look at that. That's the last thing she sent me. It's a beautiful PJ top from Etam actually, which is um, a very nice French uh, underwear and loungewear brand. I really like Etam and it says in French, le vert c'est magnifique, which means winter is magnificent. How cute. Definitely gonna wear this throughout Vlogmas. I'm gonna give some of the treats to him because he loves those. It's such a lovely Edwin present though. So thank you so, so much. I'm gonna leave a link to her channel down below if you guys Wanna check out Monica's videos?
This is my breakfast. I'm having a cup of coffee as always, an omelette from one egg, rye bread, feta cheese, cherry tomatoes, cumin seeds, olive oil, lots of lemon, lots of greenery. Looks so yummy, cannot wait to dig in. So bon appetit to me. We're off to watch our Christmas tree being lit up. I know it's gonna be super cold, so I'm wearing my a uh, huge and cozy Zara jumper and I have uh, another layer underneath my um, Zara fall leather leggings, my Chloe bag and for perfume I'm gonna wear my um, Diptyque Eau Duel because it's like a spicy vanilla it's nice when it's cold outside by the way before my auntie comes to pick us up I'm gonna open this I got a card from someone from Portugal, Claudia Martins. Um, let's see. Ooh. It says Feliz Natal. It's a Christmas card, my first Christmas card of the year. Um, oh, that's so nice. She says, I have a very busy and stressful job and I love watching your videos in order to relax a bit and clean my mind thank you for that best wishes claudia so yeah I'm, I'm glad my videos have this effect on you claudia and um thank you so much for my first christmas card of the year i'm gonna freeze to death there are five of us and then my dad and more friends will join they already lit up the tree, we were stuck in traffic. Oh, there's even a Christmas market. It's so cold, if I lose my hand while vlogging, I'm gonna blame you guys. We're going to Piccolini. There are, um, I think, seven or eight of us. Parents, friends. Yeah. Oh, Momo, are you not Yeah. 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 Hi guys, we are back from the city but I am in agony because so the story is we went to watch the Christmas tree being uh, lit up we were too late, we didn't see it but we were just on time for the fireworks they were really beautiful so I enjoyed that and the whole uh, theater square in Klaipeda was looking so beautiful. There was Christmas market, loads of people, super fun and super beautiful. And then we went to eat at this uh, lovely family restaurant called Piccolini. It's so, so cute and beautiful interior, amazing food. It used to be a French restaurant before. It used to be called Le Clé years ago. So now it's a Piccolini. Uh, restaurant they do the most amazing pizzas and like everything is so good so I had 
grapefruit lemonade with basil and then I had um, this plate of shrimp with champignons, uh, oven roasted cherry tomatoes, guacamole and some Italian bread it was so so good but I had a severe allergic reaction and I'm pretty sure it's uh, shrimps because seafood is quite allergenic and um, I had crazy allergic reaction where my my whole face was uh, covered in little underskin bumps that was years ago I, I remember I shared in one of my vlogs and I, I had shrimps that I cooked at home and soy yogurt I thought it was soy that allergized me and I never touched soy ever again and I did have shrimps afterwards absolutely love them I had them many times afterwards but now, like, I don't know what else could allergize me because I don't have allergic reaction to any of the ingredients. It couldn't be lemonade, not, I'm not allergic to grapefruit. Pretty sure it's shrimps and it's so horrible. I feel like my, my face was bitten by like a hundred ants or something. Like, I want to scratch my face so badly. Like my whole head is itchy, my neck, my chest, my back. Can you guys see this massive uh, bump on my back? But look here, I have this horrible rash with these super big bumps. Like even here, here, like my whole face. Look at that. Is that not insane? I never had anything of that sort ever before. Even my hand? I mean, like my chest is red, I'm all so itchy, I don't know what to do. Uh, my mom gave me a pill um, like to help with allergies. So I took that, I'm gonna go drink loads of water, make myself like a herbal tea or something to try and cleanse my system from whatever is causing the allergic reaction. But as much as I love shrimps, I think in the future I'm gonna have to be careful and maybe stay away from them completely because this is horrible. It's like, I just wanna scratch everywhere. Being itchy is probably one of the worst feelings ever because like you cannot do anything about it. You just wanna scratch yourself and you shouldn't because if you do, it's gonna get even worse. But yeah, like I've never ever seen anything of this sort on my face like look at the size of this bump whoa it's like i got into a fight with someone or something that was beaten in my face but it's just food you guys anyway i'm gonna survive don't worry about me but like it's it's why things like that have to happen when i'm doing vlogmas so annoying my phone doesn't stop it's so crazy that like, I get so many I had to turn off my Instagram notifications because it was like you know they were coming non-stop um, so many of you guys like the picture and commented at the moment there are 205 comments um, so over 200 people who entered the giveaway and uh, by the way, I'm not gonna choose the winner now because the giveaway has been open for like three hours. So it's too soon for me to choose the winner. I'm gonna choose the winner and add in the comment uh, at the end of the video, right before I publish um, like another day's Vlogmas so that you guys can have 24 hours to enter the giveaway, to comment and to participate. Um, that would be more fair from my point of view. You will always have to wait till the very end of the video to read the name of the winner of the giveaway. Today's giveaway is Lancome Cushion. This is Tend Idol Ultra Cushion um, Long Wear High Coverage Oil Free SPF 50. So this one is in the color number 3. I actually have this exact same one in number three as well and I use it in the summertime or when I do have quite a bit of fake tan on. So for me it's um, it's too dark but if you have a darker skin than me this will be perfect for you. So this is what it looks like. It's just a beautiful golden compact which is empty 
right now. It comes with a mirror. And here is the cushion itself. So you just insert it in here. And then you've got your beautiful Lancome cushion. Now I love Lancome base products. This one is like a very um, light texture. So it feels very light on your skin. And uh, it doesn't have a ton of coverage. I would say it's like medium coverage. It's perfect for summer or like if you don't like to wear too much um, on your face. So that is the price. All you have to do is, just like uh, with the previous giveaway, you have to go to my Instagram, make sure you follow me, like this picture under the picture, comment Chanelet Vlogmas and tag one of your friends. Some of you guys said, but I don't have anyone to tag. If you don't have friends, then tag someone who inspires you, like a celebrity, an influencer, a singer, actor, whoever you follow that inspires you, even if it's not your friend, tag him or her. Yeah, I think I'm gonna end my vlogmas here because I need to sort out my face. And um, thank you guys for watching as always and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Aren't you lucky? Aren't you lucky? Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. See, you have to thank Monica now. Monica, thank you for all my treats. They were so delicious. So, so delicious. I love them. I love them so much. Thank you. Mwah.